uh, this part, oh, this video is not really that much. I was the newest companion until you came along. I guess that's okay. Thank you for coming. Yes, youngling. Have a seat. I hear you've been busy of late. Lass, I know what you've been up to. Mind you, it's no business of mine what each companion does in the name of honor. But this sneaking around... It does not befit warriors of your standing. Ayala knows better, and so should you. In any case, I have a task for you. Have you heard the story of how we came to be werewolves? Aye, that sounds like him. As in all matters of faith, though, the reality is more complicated than one believer would tell you. The Companions are nearly 5,000 years old. This matter of beast blood has only troubled us for a few hundred. One of my predecessors was a good but short-sighted man. He made a bargain with the Witches of Glen Moral Coven. If the Companions would hunt in the name of their Lord Hircine, we would be granted great power. They did not believe the change would be permanent. The Witches offered payment, like anyone else. But we had been deceived. We'll get to that. It's not so simple as just killing them, though. The disease, you see, affects not just our bodies. It seeps into the spirit. Upon death, werewolves are claimed by Hirsing for his hunting grounds. For some, this is a paradise. They want nothing more than to chase prey with their master for eternity. And that is their choice. But I am still a true Nord. And I wish for Sovngarde as my spirit home. That's what I've spent my twilight years trying to find out. And now I've found the answer. The witch's magic ensnared us. And only their magic can release us. They won't give it willingly. But we can extract their foul powers by force. I want you to seek them out. Go to their coven in the wilderness. Strike them down as a true warrior of the wild. And bring me their heads, the seat of their abilities. From there, we may begin to undo centuries of impurity. You shall have no shield, brother, this time. But the spirit of Isgamor goes with you to restore the honor his legacy. Talos guide you, lass. the newest companion until you came along. I guess that's okay. Just means I can show you the ropes.
Skior says that I have the strength of Ysgrimor, and my brother has his smarts. And deserve our praise, you do, for we are one. Take pity, lady, and spare me a few septums. You walk among us great fellows, not as God, but as man. Once I've made enough money trading with the Khajiit caravans, I'm going to buy the Bannered Mare from Hulda. About the same as everyone else? They're the catfolk of Elsewhere. Great warriors, good traders. The way I hear it, Elsewhere ain't nothing like Skyrim. It's got tropical forests and dusty badlands. It sounds awful. Yeah, these Khajiit make a living traveling the roads and selling their wares. It's got to be tough. Skyrim's a hard enough land when you've got a roof over your head. Worst thing is, nobody wants them in the cities. Nobody trusts them. Reputation, mostly. A lot of Khajiit turn to smuggling and thievery to get by. A few bad apples spoil the bunch. You know how it is. Farewell. Want to hear a little Nord? Let's not waste any time. I'm still here. What do you need to take? Let's go. 